Well, unfortunately, I missed out on this one because I recruited them too late. Frankly, it's not that interesting of a of a paralogue. We've already seen it anyway. We'll be doing these later. The Remire Calamity. Gotta go. Now. What's going on? The situation in Ramayar village has changed drastically. We don't know much more than that. We're hearing reports that the villagers are killing each other. Some say houses are burning. Regardless, we need to move. Kill! Kill! On here. This is unbelievable. There's no way to tell who's lost their mind from who's mad with fear. If we don't act quickly, things are just going to keep getting worse. This is horrifying. I really don't want to get involved here, but we can't leave these people on their own, right? How about we hit him hard enough to knock him out, but not hard enough to kill him? That's too reckless. But, uh, I'll admit I can't think of a better option. If some must die, just know it was by the will of the goddess. Stop that, Marianne. We have to save all of them. There's no way this madness is by the will of the goddess. Nobles are responsible for the safety of the commoners. By the honor of House Gloucester, I swear that I will save them all. Claude, there are some strange-looking people here. So you notice too. Look, there's a suspicious group hiding amongst the villagers. Could they be the culprits? If so... They will not be forgiven. There you have it. Our objective is... Save as many as you can. Deal with village hostiles. I've never managed to save them all before. I always lose one or two villagers here. Ugh. There's just so much chaos. And I don't like how long loading these, these loading screens are. I'm serious. Yes. Yeah, I guess that'll be fine. You don't get very many units on this one. But as you can see, there's rampaging villagers, and you just have villagers. Save these guys as quick as you can. But here are these strange looking soldiers they mentioned. And leading them is, surrounding by them anyway, is Tomas. There are treasures here, and yes, I want them. There's one up there, and I think there's one down here. Yes. Do I have ash in my party? Yes, I do. Wonderful. Putting you over there. I'm riding with Leone. Okay. Everyone looks to be pretty well equipped. Really need to use that fruit of life on you. Let's do this. There are some suspicious looking ruffians out there, but our top priority is to rescue the villagers. Got it? 
I'll rein in the villagers who've turned violent. You focus on rescuing the others. Ready and willing. Kill! Kill! Dimitri goes freaking nuts here, by the way. In your blue lines playthrough. I got this. Leave it to me. I'll give it my all. I want to run Leone to this corner, so I'm going to run her up there with Violet because that's Let's the get to it. ship I'm going for. I'll go. Marianne will accompany them. Apologies. I stand ready. Let us away. Archers are gonna be your friend, your best bet here to save them all. Because of their extended reach. Mages will also help. Villagers are gonna make a break are just gonna make a break for it. Probably is the best thing they can do. It can't be. The one giving orders to those weird ruffians. Isn't that Tomas? There's a reason I want Leone over here. <laughs> There's a third treasure chest in the center. It's gonna be tricky to get all of them, but I will do it. I can tell you that right now. It's gonna happen. Let Raphael handle this. Punch! And here we have a level we're going to give you a new promotion. You might hear a squeaking. That's my ceiling fan. It's only like 25 years old, but it's, yeah, it's still running.
Oh yeah, just stand in the friggin' fire, brilliant. Oh, you idiot. Of course, what choice do you really have? I hope I have a horse slayer. I'm gonna need it. Yes, I have a horse slayer. Should not have used the longbow there. That's okay. Tomas, what in the world are you doing here? I'm not Tomas. My name is Solon, the savior of all. Savior? What's the matter? So shocked you can't even speak. <laughs> you were so easily fooled by my disguise. I was hiding away in Derek Mach to get the blood of that little girl called Flame. With her blood, we'll be one step closer to realizing our goal. Defeat enemy commander. And look who's here. I'll have a bit of fun here too. That's why I want Leone. That's the Death Knight. He must be an ally of Tomas, or Solon, or whoever he is. You'll notice his shield had the crest of the Adrestian Empire. Good, you have healing.
Should have switched there, but that's okay. It worked out. Once again, the Death Knight is not going to focus you until you get up on him. Excellent crit. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm getting at. It's hard to save them all. We've rescued as many as we can. Having a flyer does help with that. Yeah, I'm not gonna focus him right now. This new crescent sickle out. Another one down. Yeah, it's it hits pretty hard. Got I think there's only two chests. There was that one. Yeah, the other one's up here and Violet is going for it. God, I need to get you up there with your dark spikes. You might as well get some levels here while you're at it. Kind of a waste, I know, but hey. They say you got her a decent level. More faith skill. Let's think carefully. Predictable. Why, thank you. 
should I have held back? You are like a savage, insignificant beast. Yet you think you can kill me? Finish him off. As per usual, Geralt will not get the kill. He will put him in killing range, though. Okay, I'm just doing this for experience. Still you. Okay, let's draw you in. Get him down to one health. Your enemies, you can basically. The, the best way to describe it is. No hesitation. Yeah. You fought well. That Fun to you, watch. your allies cannot kill the commander. Comics on Animal Crossing New Horizon. How your little pop-up came in my video comic. Enjoy Animal Crossing, and again, thank you for the apples. Even a crit, no damage. It just can't be done. I have to give the killing blow. I've been playing Animal Crossing a lot in my own time. Ah. 
There's a level. I wonder how Doing that. Meanwhile, Ash, get that chest open. A horse slayer. Oh, gee, I wonder what they were implying would happen. Well, let's have you get a little taste of the sword of the creator. But that's not the only thing you're getting a taste ah, of. The cursed fell star. This will be a fine opportunity to measure your power. Let the lesson begin! And a crit to boot. I'm stronger. Why have you gone after this village? What are you planning? <laughs> I could have conducted this experiment on any test subjects. Now that I have what I came for, I must bid you farewell. Wait! Damn it, he's gone. It's over. All we can do is focus on our next move. I'll have a look around the village. There may still be people who need our help. For every villager you save, well, the more you save anyway, you get better loot. Because I saved most of them, I got two thirds of the loot. Looks like we somehow managed to sort things out, and casualties were kept to a minimum. They said they weren't picky about who they used as their test subjects. Because of them, the people of Ramire Village. There you are. That armor. So, you're the Flame Emperor. Yes. I believe you have met my subordinate, the Death Knight. I've had my run-ins. Oh, we've met all right. But back to you. You're the one responsible for the destruction of this village. Do not get the wrong idea. What in blazes does that mean? It is true that I am working with Solon, but that does not mean our objectives are the same. Had I known they planned to do this, I would have stopped it. You have my word. Your words are meaningless. Now, I'll have to insist that you accompany us back to the monastery. I cannot abide that. However, if you wish to join forces, I will hear your plea. What? what? If left to their own devices, they will commit countless more violent acts like this one. Do you not wish to prevent that? Of course I do. With the sword of the Creator on our side, Solon would not be a threat. I'm afraid I must refuse. I don't trust anyone who hides behind a mask. Pity, though not unexpected. Pray that you do not live to regret your choice. Gerald, Professor, have you seen Claude? What's wrong, kid? Huh? Damn it! He's gone. Hey, I've been meaning to talk to you. Since coming to the monastery, you've changed. How so? You've been angry since we first arrived in Ramire Village. And you look so happy when you're instructing the brats. Before the monastery, I'd never seen you bear your emotions like that. Not once. It's thanks to the students. Then perhaps it's a good thing we came to the monastery. If only so I could see your face lit up like that. Or maybe there was never any reason for us to leave the monastery in the first place. 
wasn't I born after you left the monastery? Ah, uh, I've put my foot in my mouth, haven't I? Though I suppose it may be nearly that time. Come to my office when you next have a moment to spare. There's something I need to tell you. Just what was that about? I can't recall a time of old when you were at the monastery. I wonder what is hiding in the mist that is your past. Hey, Teach. That assignment wasn't my favorite, I've got to admit. I suppose pretending to be unaffected doesn't do anyone any good. That was terrible to behold. It's always hard to see innocents die. It is. Hey, all you can do is keep smiling, keep marching. That's part of a leader's job. You can't give in to despair. Not just for me or for you, but for all of us in the Golden Deer House. We have to keep smiling so the others can move forward too. As long as we don't show that we're disheartened, they'll know they can make it too. That's what matters. Yeah, sorry for getting ahead of myself, Teach. That's how I feel, but how you handle it is really up to you. By the way, I hear that guy who calls himself the Flame Emperor showed up in Ramire Village. I he couldn't did. believe it when Hilda told me the news. What could he be after? The hero's relics. Maybe. After all, he was after the sword of the creator in the Holy Mausoleum. But then they kidnapped Flane and used her blood for their recent attack. Based on that, we should probably assume that their true objective is something other than the relics, don't you think? What do they want with Flane's blood? They called this incident an experiment, and they said they got what they came for. That means they might take this success and attempt something even bigger next time. Sadly, that's all we can assume. There are far too many things we still don't know. Flame, your timing is impeccable. Would you care to join us for a while, fair lady? What? Why? Oh my. Damn, she gave us the slip. In any case, I doubt she knows the full story. It seems more like she has something on her mind that she can't divulge. You're pushing too hard. Seems like it would be better to push Sedith for an explanation. Or, best of all, to go above his head and ask Rhea. Now that we know Tomas was an enemy, we can't be sure that exposing the Church's secrets would be to our benefit. Where are the answers I seek? Where are they? I don't know. You did well handling that awful business in Umayyar village. I am certain the goddess shares in our grief at the senselessness of that calamity. More importantly, I was shocked to hear that our own Tomas was actually a dark mage. I must reflect on our blindness. You surely must. You failed to notice that a rat was hiding in your home. Pathetic! Who are these wicked foes? How did Tomas escape your gaze? Who are those villains? Tomas came to the monastery 40 years ago, by recommendation of House Ordelia of the Alliance. Around eight years ago, he went back to House Ordelia, before returning to the monastery once again, just last year. After having worked at Garigmok for decades, why would he betray us now? Just what did he hope to accomplish? Perhaps that was not the real Tomas. Perhaps he replaced him and killed him. Yuritsa became a professor at the Officer's Academy because of a recommendation from the Imperial Nobility. Supposing that he is the Death Knight, and he is our enemy is probably an organization the Death Knight. that has taken root in at least two territories. In the long history of the Church of Seros, no, long before even that, there have been an endless number of threats to the peace of Fodlin. Yet those who oppose us still operate in the shadows. Their identity is a mystery. I believe that Solon and the Death Knight are merely one part of a much larger whole. A threat to Fodlin's peace? That means we have no choice. We have to stop them all. 
they must be stopped. I have truly come to rely on you. I believe that the monastery will remain safe so long as we have you. We do not yet know the enemy's objective or whereabouts. For now, please devote yourself to preparing for whatever comes next. That is all for today. Professor, please wait. I know there is much that you still do not understand. However, one thing is clear. You possess great power. I believe that you are destined to be a source of great hope for all. In any case, I expect great things from you. Walk this world proudly, dear Professor. May the Goddess Sothis protect you. The Goddess Sothis? Is that what she just said? Is something the matter? I've never heard the name of the Goddess. Ooh. I see. Sothis is the Goddess's true name. Please do not use it carelessly. Farewell. Do not say something that we may regret. She... I... What exactly am I? For now, let's leave this place. Please, go. I'm gonna end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Fire Emblem Three Houses as we continue through the story. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph. Signing off, and wow, that was a generic closing comment.